I was a chartered accountant. And halfway through my career, I've decided I'm going to do something else and moved into the IT industry. And here I am working for New Zealand's innovation agency. I'm not a scientist or an engineer or even you know, a business innovation expert, so I would definitely define my role as try to get the right expert to build that team and then kind of to help the ecosystem accelerate. At Callaghan Innovation, what's a great thing about working here is we have experts in all different fields and sectors and industries. For me, what's really exciting is that I get the opportunity actually just to work with them um, and stay on the edge of what's coming next and not just what's now. We're very excited about the future, especially in the AI and Web3 space. And as we can see, the technology is just moving so fast. There are 30% of female representation in the STEM area. It is definitely a huge problem, but I think at the same time, it also presents a huge amount of opportunities. There are many times I step into a meeting room, uh, you know, there could be 10 or 15 male, and I'm the only female uh, in the room. So my advice would be, be proud of that. Um, don't be afraid, and you go tell them, thank you, I'm here to bring diversity to the table. There are just heaps of opportunities out there. So use the example of myself, um, not technical, not scientist, with a counting background, who would thought I would be <laughs> in this role. Um, and currently, you know, looking at AI or Web3 um, initiatives um, that potentially could really make an impact for New Zealand. So that's definitely the message I want to give out there is, yeah, don't underestimate yourself. Um, don't worry about the past, even though you don't have the right experience or background just always give it a go.